and now we have a heart line from Kathleen in the United States. Dear Master, thank you so much for always pampering us and sending us so many blessings and miracles. Each Christmas, you always bless me with a gift, such as a chance to read a voiceover on Supreme Master Television or a gift from SM Celestial Clothing. One year, I was wishing I could buy a SM Celestial necklace and all of a sudden, I got a bonus at work. Last Christmas, you blessed me to visit some initiated brothers and sisters in Montana and it was such a treat. It was an oasis, a blessing, a true retreat for our souls. I truly enjoyed the blessings and company of the mountain gods, the snow angels and all the tree deities. They send us so much love and blessings that I was moved to tears. As I sat on the ski lift, I could feel the love radiating into my heart. I was immensely surprised by how strong the love felt. You also blessed me with a chance to serve. The weather turned incredibly cold and we fed the homeless brothers and sisters in 40 degrees Celsius below zero weather with wind chill. At one point, the soup on the initiated brother's hand froze solid while he ladled the piping hot soup bowls for each person. Thank you, Master, for always reminding us how truly blessed we are to be able to walk on the planet at the same time as a living Master. What a rare gift it is to be a disciple of a living Master, and we even get to sit down each day to commune with God Almighty and Tim Ku too when we practice the Queen Yin method of meditation. Thank you, Master, for always loving us and your endless sacrifice in coming down to planet Earth in human form. We are infinitely grateful. May God Almighty infinitely bless you, infinitely protect you, and infinitely protect your peace always. Your undeserving and ever grateful disciple, Kathleen from the United States. Happy Kathleen. Thank you for your lovely heart line. Master would like to shine some of her boundless light onto you through these kind words. Affectionate Kathleen, thank you for your love and appreciation. An open heart is the best receiver of divine blessings. That is why you always feel taken care of. By serving others joyfully, we complete the circle and give as we receive, which is the natural flow of life. All good comes from God, and we in this world are only his humble instruments. Therefore, we must serve each other, and that is how we create heaven on earth. Thank you for doing your part, my love, and keep up the good work. May you and the gracious American people be blessed